Hello everyone, I'm Sharpedo43 once again, bringing you all week 5 of the PGL. We're going to be facing Route 81 and um, the New Jersey Robots. Um, as you can see, we're back to the live recording in um, in the Wi-Fi battles for the PGL just because... Um, last week I couldn't do it live because while I recorded everything live, everything was just um, not going through it in terms of my voice. Like, my voice wasn't going through while I was recording everything live, so... Um, Therefore, there was no voice. Therefore, everything was just went to hell, and I didn't really feel like re live recording everything because that was just that would just be a waste of time. So, yeah. So unfortunately, I had to do it postcom last week, but now we're back, and I'm making sure that my mic is not muted this time. So everything should be where it is. And I apologize if you hear any background noise. It's just that everybody's in the house right now, and unfortunately, there's nothing I can really do about that. This is the only time I have ch um, to battle Root because I'm not gonna be able to battle him tomorrow because tomorrow we're going out um, snowboarding or something. And um, Saturday I'm just gonna be working all day, and Sunday is gonna be my birthday, so I'm probably just gonna be busy doing other things, probably spending time with family or, or something. So um, definitely, this is the only chance I have. And even if I had to deal with all the noisiness that is my family, I I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. But yeah, anyways, enough wasting time. Let's just get into the battle. This is the team I brought against Root. Hopefully, it works out. And yeah. Uh, Root is interestingly uh, a guy who also does a lot of draft leagues as far as I'm aware does the PGBL which is a, another draft league that kind of gets in the way of the PGL by the way which is kind of funny but um, at the same time a little annoying because when I'm trying to look up PGL videos I can almost never find them but uh, yeah uh, we'll play this battle because uh, I haven't heard this battle in a while so yeah um, uh, uh, have fun uh, Root because um, that's what I'm gonna try to do as well. So, uh, yeah. What can I say? Um, so yeah, the team that I brought, I mean, hopefully with what I have right now, I can actually do very well. This, th let me tell you, this league is really, really dang hard as far as I'm aware, because, or as far as I've gone through so far, because, I mean, I don't know, everybody just seems to f play differently nowadays. It's because I have to keep worrying about them bringing some counter stuff or something like that. Okay, but let's see what he has on his team. Enough rambling already. Okay, so he did bring Zygarde. It's the 50% Zygarde, of course. I do have an advantage in the sense that my Zygarde 10% um, is actually going to be able to outspeed that thing. Unless his is actually Scarfed, which will be kind of inconvenient. I don't remember if his Zam was actually the Mega. Damn. I'll just assume it's Mega Zam. But if it's Sash Zam or something, pff, ya valió. But um, here we go. Prime Arena. He has a Prime Arena. Prime Arena is dangerous, that I can assure you. You guys have seen when I use Prime Arena in my Wi-Fi battles, you've seen how much of a pain in the rear end it could be. He has Delmise, Rapid Spinner to get rid of my rocks, which is really annoying, and I don't have any spin blockers, which is probably the worst thing here. He has an annoying Mon in Umbrian. You guys saw when I battled Fulham, I was always afraid of that thing, and I think now I don't even have a knockoff user to prevent it from getting recovery. I don't have a taunt user, I don't have any of the stuff that I could have, um, had to de deal with this, um, what's it called? Umbrian. I mean, I do have Hitmonchan, but it's not gonna one-shot it, and neither is Diancie unless I've gotten prior damage onto it, so... This could be a bit of a problem. Like, uh, this, ba this battle, in terms of matchup, could be an issue. But anyways, what do I lead off with? I only got 9 seconds. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, boy. Ah, uh, gotta go lead with this, gotta lead with this. I just picked random, because I honestly don't know what to lead with, with this, against this guy. I just gotta hope it works out. I live with, I think, Rotom. Yeah, Rotom Heat. I don't know if that's a good matchup or not, but I, right now I don't have time. <sighs> okay, but here we go. Good luck and fun route. Not too much luck though, because that shit has been costing me a lot of battles recently. Especially in the draft format. And I don't want that to keep repeating itself, because come on now. It's going way too far. But anyways, okay, so he does lead with this thing. I don't know how I feel about that in all honesty. And I don't remember if this was actually a Spadef um, Rotom or was it something else? Because if it was something else, we could have issues here. And looking at this right now, something tells me we're about to have a connection error. Okay, or is, or this battle's just too slow. What type of Rotom is this? Summary. Mmm, this is my defensive one. What is this, um, what's it called as? Hmm. I want to Volt Switch really, really badly, but um, I don't want to take a Psychic either. 
Yeah, I don't want to take a Psychic either. And seeing how he stays in tells me that he might want to just go for that. It's a Mega. If it's Substitute, I don't think I lose much by going for this thing. I don't remember if I made this the Cosmos, but Death Investor. I think I did, but I could be dead wrong on that. Prism Armor. Ooh, that could be bad, actually. The good news is that I actually prevented myself from taking too much damage. That actually did a lot. Like, yeesh. That was a resisted hit, too. Okay. The good news about this is that he cannot set up any stealth rocks. Or he cannot set, um, just... Hmm. Hmm. This is kind of interesting. It does a lot of damage. If I switch out right now... And just go for Photon Geyser. Do I want to do that, though? I do want to get in damage on this thing. In case it comes down to... Yeah, I just want to get damage on this thing. He's going to switch it up to Shadow Ball, which could do a lot, just given how much that, that did earlier. Why is this doing so much damage? It does, like, a ridiculous amount of damage. I know, that doesn't do too much because of the prism, uh, the prism armor that I just gave it. Which does suck. But damn, this did a lot, and he might actually try to predict me this time. Yeah, but this does way too much damage, like a ridiculous amount of damage. Like, this is a lot more damage than I expected. He could try to go for- what did I need Rotom for again? What do I have on this Hitmonchan? No priority moves on Hitmonchan? I don't know how I feel about that. What do I have on this Diancy? <sighs> I'm, a, I'm in a little bit of a predicament here. Do I have even recovery on this thing? I do, so do I need this in the long run? Do I have Toxic on this thing? I don't have Toxic on this thing. I can lose what's it called right now. Shit, man. Do I just lose Hitmonchan? I have to lose something though. That's that's kind of clear right now. I have to lose something right now, which is really really annoying. If I lose Rotom, I lose an option to toxic the hell out of that Umbrian. That's going to be a pain in the ass. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna have to do this right now. Fuck. Why is this Sam hitting way too hard? I don't think I remember these things hitting this hard unless they're in psychic terrain or something. He does predict my switch, which really really sucks. It does way too much damage. It does way too much damage and I think I'm switching out for no reason and just letting things die right now. It's because I want to get my rocks up too, that's another thing. Okay, we'll just go into this thing. Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna go into this thing. We're just gonna let this thing die I guess, because right now... I'm not getting anywhere with this. Yeah, this thing, like, he, him leading with this is actually pff, a crit. Damn. You're gonna be really that harsh about it? Okay, but let, let's go into... What's it called here? Okay. We're gonna go for a Quiver Dance right here. Actually, hmm, do I want to go for Quiver Dance? Hmm. Do I want to go for Quiver Dance? I'll go for Quiver Dance. He's gonna go for the fucking Psychic. Damn. And then he brings Psyguard and then just... Another crit. Jeez. I'm lucky I got I was Focus Sashed here. Because this thing would have been such an issue. Unfortunately, I cannot sweep with this thing. This was, this was planned for late game, but because I'm already losing Mons really, really quickly thanks to this thing... Yeah. I, I honestly don't know what to do. I'm gonna just, um... Bug Buzz this thing, because this thing needs to die, really. Actually, Bug Buzz was not the answer because um, this thing has the prismatic, um, the prism armor. At least kill it. Okay, good, because damn, this thing was being a little bit of a bitch. Stupid ass freaking. But now my problem is the Zygarde. That thing can just come in and yeah. He's going straight into daddy. <sighs> yay. What do I sack now that I don't have this thing? It's because that's the thing, I can't really sack anything. The sticky webs. 
Okay. Um. Let's see. I think this Hitmachan is also not even, um... Or is it? I think it is. Okay, yeah, I think it is. Never mind. Um... I guess let this thing go down to E speed. Should I? I don't have switch into 1000 arrows anyways. You know what? Nah. Let's just go for Moonblast. It's gonna go for the E speed. I wanna believe this is a banded one too. Okay. I, uh, yeah, I have to go into Hitman Chat. Because here's the thing. I'm going to go straight for the Ice Punch. I think I'm playing way too predictably right now, but because I'm super be behind, I feel like I have to make these plays. Nothing switches into a Ice Punch other than um, Prime Arena either, so... I dare him to try to actually switch in Prime Arena. Mm. This could be a problem because, yeah, if I mispredict and his prime arena is faster than my Hitmonchan, we're kind of in an issue. <sighs> I need the freaking, um, yeah, he's going to switch out. He's probably going to go into prime arena. Clarice. Okay. I don't know if I'm faster than this thing right now. That's kind of my biggest issue right now. It's doing a lot of damage despite the resistance so i don't know if this thing if this means that this thing is actually i'm gonna risk it i'm gonna go for this right now yes it outspeeds okay get this out of here yeah prime marine is gone that's one crisis averted two mons are down already okay what what, what else do i have to worry about here i don't think he'll bring in nihiligo because nihiligo uh, doesn't carry side shark so yeah it's not a switch in the hitman chat either sludge wave will not kill because i Oh no, I'm life orb, am I? I don't think it'll KO though. Unless it's specs. If his thing is specs. Hmm. Okay. I am in a little bit of a problem though. And it is the that the um the Zygarde is um gonna be an issue. If that thing starts to set up in my face, it could be a problem. What does he have left on his team? He has Delmice, which I can just um it's because at this point, I don't have any switch-ins for anything on this team. I'm also afraid of the Zygarde having um, Roselli Berry for my Diancy to take a Moonblast and then retaliate with a thousand arrows. Ay, ay, ay. That Zam ruined a lot of my plans, let's be real here. And now, right now, my biggest problem is the Umbreon. Because I don't got anything for that thing. I have Diancy, but... Yeah, that thing has like toxic or something. Well, let's be real here. It's not gonna go for it, but you know. I'm also afraid of the Zygarde. If not Roselli Berry, it's probably like a Scarf one, just because he knows that my. I think the good thing about this though is that he doesn't have any Rock Setters, so I have my Sash. Um, what's it called? Browser Hist. He's gonna go into this. Unless this thing is Choice Specs, I don't think a Sludge Wave kills from uh, my Hitman Chan, and I can hit this thing for some good damage with Drain Punch. Let's hope, let's hope. If this disconnects, I already know what the outcome is. So, I don't think recreating is a big deal. Is it Specs? It's not Specs, it gets the poison. Seriously, man, 10% chance to get that poison. Yeah, kill this thing, god damn. This RNG really, like, loves to attack me, doesn't it? Gets the poison, man. Seriously. This RNG is so ridiculous. This RNG is actually pissing me off, let me tell you that. 10% <sighs> chance to get the poison. Okay, so he's now going to go into probably Zygarde. Go for Thousand Arrows. What other choices he have? Because honestly, if, if um, his Zygarde wasn't Scarf, he would have gone into it right now. But he, instead he went to Nihiligo. That might have been a misplay. I don't know. But yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Not gonna lie, I'm a little tilted just because of that um poison. It's cause like first he get I, he gets like double crits with the um with the Zam and now he gets a 10% chance poison. 
I mean, the first crit on Zam didn't matter, but the second one, if I wasn't Sash, that would have mattered a great ton. Probably. But anyways, here comes this thing. I don't know what this thing wants to do. Probably foul play me to death. I don't know. Because he's not sending in Zygarde, which would have been the, the actual switch, in my opinion. I don't know why he's going into Umbrian. This thing doesn't take this very well at all. And, um... Unless he's just trying to bait me so that I go for Drain Punch? I don't know, man. Foul play. Okay. I'm guessing he has no switches to this thing? Okay, but here's this, though. Here's this. Um... Do I want to Ice Punch? It's because what, what if he stays in? This Drain Punch did that much. You know what? <sighs> he could definitely switch in, um, what's it called right here? Um, do I Ice Punch here? Because I feel like he's going to switch into Delmise right now, seeing that I'm going for a Drain Punch. I don't, why would he leave this in here? Is he that capable? Let me see. Let's see if he switches out. So seeing how he hasn't made a move tells me that maybe he'll switch out. Yeah, he switched out. He was he was trying to get me to go into um, Fletcher. Okay, this is not a big deal to me, honestly. Because, look, what I want to do right here now... Yeah, he, he's going to get me poisoned, but that's whatever. What I can do here is weaken this thing just to get the... Just to get as much damage on this thing as possible. If he switches in the... What's it called? Um, Yeah, he's going to send in back the Umbrian. Hopefully I can just KO it here because I'm life orbed. Ice Punch. What he's trying to do is wither me down with um, Life Orb here and Poison. Hmm. I'm debating what I should do here, actually. Because I'm going to lose Hitma Chad. Hmm. Do I want to lose... what's it called here? Do I want to lose... Oh, hit my chat here. Because I'm going to lose him. I think I lose him no matter what though, in all honesty. Because I can just switch out, go into Necrozma. You know what? I'll just go for Ice Punch, fuck it. I'll go for Ice Punch. I'll lose him on top. Hopefully this Delmise doesn't reverse sweep me, because that would actually be annoying, so we don't have to use, worry about Umbrian's freaking ridiculous um, shenanigans. Okay, I have an idea right here. Okay, I definitely have an idea here. He doesn't have Stealth Rockers, so I think I'm definitely safe in just sending in... Necrozma just to get some chip on the on the Delmice. If he sends in Delmice. He sends out Fletcher, which is the Delmice. Okay. I just want some chip on this thing. I don't think this thing outspeeds me. I don't think he invested enough speed to outspeed Necrozma here. Do I need rocks? I don't think I need rocks, so we'll just go for the knockoff. Just to knock off its item on the off chance it's something like a choice band or something. If he brings in Zygarde and then tries to like set up Dragon Dances or something, that's fine with me too because my uh, Zygarde ten percent is actually sashed. So even a crit plus seven um, Dragon Dance is not gonna take me out <laughs> or outrage. I meant to say. So he's gonna switch out into what's it called? I don't remember if this was his. Um... I don't remember if this was actually his. Um... Oh, ooh. now this is interesting. He's actually making this thing healthy. Hold on. I, I, I'm still not worried about this thing. Go for Photon Geyser. Dragon Dance. Yeah, he's Dragon Dancing the hell out of me right now. Yeah, like I said, I'm not worried because he doesn't have rocks up, so I don't really, I'm not really worried about this thing. Good to know he's not Choice Scarf, though, because that was actually my biggest concern. 
I dare you to try to go for a second Dragon Dance. I dare you, my guy. I dare you. No, you're not. <laughs> okay. Critical hit. Jeez, man. Seriously. This game just wants to rub in my face. Okay. Obviously, I would have Dragon Dance myself. But I cannot risk this guy um, e-speeding me after hitting me with an attack. So, yeah, obviously, I'm just going to go into... Go for Outrage, obviously. He has no switch into uh, Outrage right now. There's no way I can possibly lose right now. Because I go for Outrage, he switches out. Loses plus one, and I'm sashed. There's no way I'm going to like. There's no way. Mold Breaker doesn't break those sashes, does it? This doesn't carry Mold Breaker, does it? I don't think Z moves go through sash either. I don't think so. If it does, I'd be actually astonished if um, Z moves actually do go through sa focus sash. But I don't think they did. I don't think they do. I think the last time I tried to do this, um. I had a Sash Pokemon and someone tried to Z-move me? Yeah, okay, it doesn't. Oh, okay, thank god. That means I actually get a free kill on this damn Zygarde. That's what we're talking about. Finally get a win in the PGL after three straight losses in a row. Sheesh, man. But damn, these battles are all freaking close. I don't think I'm gonna make it to playoffs with these kinds of results, honestly. Every battle I lose is very, very close. But every other battle that I win, which only has been two so far in this season, they've all been way too close. It's either 2 0s or 1 0s. It's crazy. If he DCs right here, I mean. We know the results now. It's gonna be a 1 0 here. Actually, you know what? Unless this thing is actually AV, we might actually lose. Again. Damn it all. Is this actually gonna happen? Now I'm actually debating. Okay, so Outrage did that much. Is it right for me to go for the, 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 I have to Mega Evolve instantly, remember that, sheesh, it's last time I, do I want to go for the, okay, Zygarde Outrage did that much, but Z Diancy has, is this, uh, I don't know if this thing is, um, AV or not, it could be, and if it is, I might just lose right now, and I don't know if Diamond Storm would, um, KO it from where it's at. I, I, I would love to do the calc because that could actually get me out of the doubt, but I'm too lazy to do that. So, do I want to go for Moonblast or do I just want to go for the Diamond Storm and just hopefully KO it? Diamond Storm did this much to it. To the Delmice. Diamond Storm did this much. Or, no, 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 Outrage did this much. Is it is it a Solvest or is it Di- Oh, man. I think I'm going to go for Diamond Storm just to get the plus two defense. Possibly. It's because I don't know if this thing is AV or not. Do I AV, do I go for the Moonblast? Or do I go for the plus two defense? <sighs> I don't know. Do I go for the Moonblast? Man, I don't know. I just clicked Diamond Storm! Oh my god. Oh, I wasn't certain. I wasn't certain. Now I just gotta hope I get the plus two defense, and if if I get it, um, I gotta live the the the. Damn. This might not kill it. That's the thing. I don't get it, and it fucking connects. Damn it! I wanted to go for the damn play rough. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I wanted to go for the moonblast, but I wasn't sure. Man, and this was a misclick too. Damn it! I lost again. Damn it! I thought I was gonna win this, and I didn't win it again. Jeez. Fuck. Okay, now I don't think I'm gonna make it to playoffs, man. Now I don't think I'm gonna make it to playoffs. But whatever. Good game nonetheless, Root. That was pretty good. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. I, I misclicked too. But again, if, if his um, Delmice was Assault Vested, I probably would have lost anyways. It would have just come down to him missing that move anyways. But damn, man. This is like the fourth loss in a row. Fourth loss in a row though. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, I think, yeah. What did I do wrong? Probably letting my, probably switching in, um, what's it called, Rotom to take damage was probably the biggest misplay I made there. Yeah, I think that was the case. Yeah, 
I think that was what happened. I think the initial part of the battle was what, like where I where I messed up. I saw that my um, Necrozma took way too much damage. I let it trace m the. Pr I think I should have let Rotom take damage first turn, then um, Volt Switch, then go into Necrozma and go for knockoff. I think that would have been the way to keep my Pokemon healthy because that was that was the biggest problem I had in the beginning of the battle was just that I was letting too much stuff get in the way, or I was letting this Zam get away uh, get away with too much. And that just ended up costing me in the end. But yeah, it that was that was my fault actually. Yeah, this was all my fault in the end. Damn. <sighs> I thought I had a chance with Root, but now I don't think I have any chance against anybody else, honestly. I don't think I'm gonna make it to playoffs now that I think about it, just because yeah, I'm I'm one in four now. Which yeah, one in four. This is week five. We only have five more weeks of this and I think the only people who make it to playoffs are the the top four in each division or something like that in each yeah in each division i think that's how it works i don't know but um with these kinds of results i don't think i'm going anywhere honestly it's another one no but still like three l's no four l's in a row two oh from trexo uh two oh from sarine grace and then one oh from i don't remember his name and um one oh from root Damn. I mean, like, the differential is not bad, but still, it's like a, a loss is a loss, man. A loss is a loss. That's just crazy. Oh well. And who's my week six opponent? It's the. the. the Chatham Charizards. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, so. Yeah, well. I don't know why I'm talking too much right now, but, anyways, um, thank you all for watching week five of the pgl as you can see we just lost again which is wow ridiculous uh i, I told you i told you <laughs> after um winning my week four battle against um one crash 94 in the ngdl i told you i was gonna come back to just losing more battles i told you this would happen and i still haven't even battled my week five opponent yet so imagine am i actually gonna just start losing again that's exactly what i was saying but whatever this, ba this battle was still a good battle nonetheless. Um, it was a 1-0, which is not really that bad. But again, it's just because it's in a league, it's kind of hard for me not to take the loss very, very, like, you know, poorly and whatnot. But anyways, thank you all for watching week 6. Stay tuned for um, week 5 of the PGL. And stay tuned for week 6. And until then, I'll catch you guys for the next battle. But for now, just take it easy.